Number eight for Galway is Michael Connolly. Number nine for the Limerick man standing beside him. That is Dave Punch and the other two centre field men. Steve Mann on the left for Galway and on the right is Jimmy Carroll and the game is on and it's Jimmy Carroll. Joe Connolly in there. Leonard Enright still in there. Out to this side of the field now with 34. Four going through. short to Michael Connolly being chased by David Punch but chased is the word TJ Malloy putting inside it's a goal it's a goal by TJ Malloy TJ seemed to tumble himself on the ground Mossy Carroll going up for it. Jimmy Carroll. A, a goal, a goal deflected, deflected by Eamon Cregan. Eamon Cregan deflecting that one. Eamon, who was hidden just in front of the goal, quite legally so. Jimmy Carroll bringing this one down. Sylvie Laban, Mossy Carroll. Cregan coming out through the Connor Hayes after him. What a lovely dummy he saw. What a lovely shot. What a lovely point. Eighteen minutes gone in the first half. Joe Connolly. And John Connolly getting it up in his hand. He shot at a point. towards Brian Carroll and here comes Brian Brian with a long ball way up the field Joe McKenna goes for Bernard McInerney and Joe McKenna's got it he takes a shot and it's the goal a goal for Liberal and Joe McKenna is the scorer a lovely dropping ball into the goal mouth and it's Eamon Cregan the referee has blown his whistle it's a penalty it's a penalty the referee walked up and he's pointed for a penalty. And the penalty means three men in the goal. Eamon Cregan to take the shot. At the moment, five points between them. I'm sure he's going to try for a goal. The stone walls of the Tlagger are in there in the goal mouth. And standing over the ball, Eamon Cregan, Limerick's chief scorer. He stands back to get a bit of power into the drive. Here it comes. It's a goal. There's the final whistle. Galway are the champions. Galway 2.15, Limerick 3.9. And look at that for excitement.